You, the Chosen of Regeneration, offer your prayers at the altar. Yes, my lord. O oh, Goddess Martell, great protector and nurturer of the earth, grant me thy strength. Colette, my dear daughter, you have done well. Thank you. F the Guardian of the Seal has fallen, and the first seal has been released. Ifrit will surely awaken soon. In the name of Crucius, I shall grant you the power of the angels. Thank you, my lord. The angel transformation will not be without pain, yet it is but for one night. Be strong and endure. I humbly accept this trial. The next seal lies far to the east, across the sea. Offer your prayers at that altar. Yes, Lord Remuel. I shall await you at the next seal, the Chosen of Regeneration, my beloved daughter Colette. Colette has wings! Uh-huh, and look, I can put them away too. Oh wow, that's so cool! Here, look, look! That the next place is across the sea. That means we get to sail on a ship. <laughs> I can't wait. A ship? Hmm. I wonder if there are any ships sailing with the way things are right now. We should head to the coast to see what we can find. Okay, you two, we get it already. That's enough. Okay. Not much of a specimen. Oh, trick yeah. work.
I'm... fine. You don't look fine at all. Your face is completely white. It's all my fault. I got carried away and kept making her pull her wings in and out. I don't think that has anything to do with it. Now's not the time for that. Her lips are turning purple. We must get her to a doctor in the city immediately. Wait. It's best not to move her. Why? Remember the Angel's words. The Angel transformation process requires her to overcome a trial. Rather than taking her to a doctor, it would be best to let her rest here. I'm... okay. I'll be fine after a little rest. I'm sorry to cause so much trouble. Stop apologizing all the time, you dork. It's not as if you can help it. You were suddenly turned into an angel. You're right. I'm sorry. <sighs> well, anyway, let's set up camp before it gets dark. Oh yeah, I know it's kind of late now, but here's your birthday present. Oh no, it's broken. I wonder when it broke. I'm sorry, I'll make you a new one. Thanks. And I'm sorry that I keep causing trouble for you. Don't worry about it. By the way, you haven't been eating at all. Are you still feeling sick? No. I'm fine. I just don't seem to have much of an appetite. You won't be able to keep up your strength if you don't eat. I know, you're right. <coughs> Lloyd, don't push her. Colette is delicate, unlike you. Shut it! I'm sorry, Colette. No, no, I'm okay. I'm really sorry for worrying you. I'm gonna go for a little walk. Want me to come? Thanks, but I'll be fine by myself. Ha ha! You got rejected! Hey, shut up, genus. 
Ugh. <coughs> What's happening to me?